Welcome back to Final Fantasy VI. Advanced. Are you ready? Yes, I am. Protect the Esper from Kafka. Would you like an explanation? No, I don't feel it's necessary. So this is what I like to do. I like to put Vaga in his own party, because his tool command really does a good number on pretty much everything. So that's great. So now I want to also have a super team ready. Which will consist of four characters, which may be a little bit of overkill. But that's okay. Overkill is what I want to achieve. And then put Celeste and Gart in the same team. Then she can absorb stuff with Runic and he can just stray cat things. So this is about as even as I could hope. Minus the one overpowered party, of course. Here they come! Here I come with my, my controller aid device. Got myself a new strap, too. Because I, I also bought a, a real guitar. Oh, if it isn't General Celeste, the traitor! Excellent! Now I won't have to hunt you down later! Laugh, 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 laugh. Yeah, in case anyone watching cares about guitars, I got myself a Fender Squire Strat. It's, uh, I guess it's a pretty good gu beginner guitar, so yay for me. Go, get those vial insects. Yeah, because I just went to a local music store and I was all like, I'm just gonna buy this, this guitar randomly. Like, I just kind of went down to browse and it was a really nice looking guitar, I thought. And it was just calling my name. It was a nice metallic green color. So I'm, uh, I'm gonna get around to playing it at some point. I might even, like, try to twitch some Rocksmith with it. Because that's the only way I'm going to be able to learn. Because I don't have the attention span, really, to learn guitar, but I already know Guitar Hero pretty well. And I don't want to waste the, uh, the finger dexterity and whatnot that I've accumulated from Guitar Hero. And it's a next step up from Guitar Hero, so yeah, it's like a good little stepping stone for me. So we'll see, I got a few days off coming up here soon, I might play a little bit of the Geek Box. Um, let's... Well, I, so far it's not too bad, I just hope I don't get surrounded, or else... It might not be so great. But I did, as you may have noticed, equip the Black Belt on Vaga, so... If anyone hits him, he might counterattack, and that time he decided to counterattack every time, because he's all like, I'm all by myself, so I, yeah, you, you're a dog, and you have, and you flee. You have fleas. And Vaga will also gain all kinds of levels in the meanwhile. Alright, so we got a couple more of these corporals. Let's punish these corporals with corporal punishment? That would make sense. And let's have Cyan do some Genji Glove action. Am I going to attack this enemy twice with Cyan? Yes, Cyan! How do you put up with my bad puns? I find there's, like, a bad pun can be... Like, I'm just as satisfied with a bad pun as a good pun, so long as... Either someone laughs, or appears that I hurt their soul. That's all I ask for. Well, maybe I won't need to use that other team. Oh yeah, now we got these guys surrounded. This is... This is looking pretty swanky right now. Let's steal from this dog from behind. And then hit this man in the back. Ooh, a high potion. Hi, potion! How are you? Or maybe it's under the influence of drugs. There's a lot of variables. These hunting hounds, they just keep on running away. I'm not going to be able to acquire any of them with GART at this rate. And then we're going to get another wave here shortly. Noise blaster, go! I probably should have just used the... the bio blaster and been done with it. But it does nullify some some of that damage. So long as I'm halfway 
on top of things. Because it doesn't take too long for one guy to get overwhelmed. I'd really like to get back to him so I can at least heal him a little bit, or get Celeste in, in position so she can shoulder some of the load here. So allow me to do more damage stuff. I'm going to steal a potion and cast all kinds of fire and attack two more. Two more, two more times. I had something to address, but I can't remember. I'm not wearing a dress. And I am dressed, so no matter. I'm not sure if I have Fire Dance. I probably don't. I haven't been paying any attention. But if not... Oh well. Not a big deal. Yeah, do the swing! Swing! Yay. Ooh, Drain. Alright, Celeste, let's convalesce. Next turn, I should probably get Vaga to take a step back. Let's Bioblast, see if that just doesn't take them out in one shot. Because if it does, I'm going about this in a really idiotic fashion. I mean, outside of the, the countering, providing a little bit of padding. Yeah, I was just doing that like a dummy. So let's get... Vaga out of the way. Let's fall back. Well, at least Celeste is blocking the way now. So she'll get some fight. Ooh, Fidor. Is that what you would call, like, the little doggy doors that they walk through? A Fidor? Just curious, that's all. I haven't had a dog in a long time. I was... I had a dog when I was... well, it wasn't, like, my dog, it was the family dog. When I was, like, three? It died when I was, like, four or five. Let's heal with, uh... healing. There. Then switch back... to my power team. Whether I like it or not. And let's utilize Drain. Because I have some liquids I must dispense of. Which is generally what Drain is for. I can't tell if my mouse pointer's on the screen. Sorry if you guys saw that for like... 20 minutes. It never used to show up in OBS, now all of a sudden it's there. But maybe you can't see it at all and you're like, Mega Harv, what are you talking about? It's just, I don't know, some stupid crap like I normally do. And yes, it seems that I feel it's necessary to show all of these battles. Like, that's kind of the whole point of this part, like an action sequence. If I skip all the action sequence, what's what's left of this game, especially? Like, there's just something about the enemies, too, when them being able to attack freely, that I find just helps keep the flow of things going a little more quickly than, say, a mother game. I feel like I touched on that once before, but... So no, I, it's probably a safe bet that you haven't watched every video I've ever made. I'm not sure I've watched every video I've ever made. There's probably one or two that I missed. Like, outside of the... the editing process. The editing proces. I don't think I really went in-depth on what I equipped on people. I'm trying to remember what I equipped on Vaga. Well, the, the counter bracelet, and I gave him the hyper wrist too, excuse me. That thing had a- she had- that had a mithril sword. I don't think that's, like, super good or anything, but it's worth, I don't know, a few hundred gil, I'm, sh I'm sure. I have all kinds of stuff to sell. At the ready. So we have about 13 adversaries to dispense of here. Steal, I meant to steal from the dog. Because I don't know what it has. But I feel like it should have something decent. And I'm not even sure who I'm focused on right now. Vaga, I'd like to heal my power team. I may as well do it with magic rather than waste more money. 
abilities such as curing myself and my buddies. Well, not Cyan, he's not really Terra's buddy. They're... they're somewhat untrustworthy of each other at the moment. They have a... they just have a little bit of hashing out to do with each other. They'll be fine, they just gotta... They just gotta find a little bit of common ground, that's all. It's the best way to, uh, make amends. Find a little bit of common ground. Not even amends, for that matter. Okay, I gotta make sure- okay. Because I was thinking maybe he'll just go up that- that empty- Of course this would be the heavy armor. Uh, but I will use the bio blast to get rid of those two corporals. I don't like Vaga's chances of taking a heavy armor by himself. I meant to put him in the back row, I'm not sure if I had. Well, he seems to be absorbing damage. Well, let's turn this thing around, see if, uh, I can't get this Magitek armor to attack itself. There we go. That should speed things up, and it doesn't even unconfuse it when that happens. And I probably can bioblast it and keep it confused. Because a lot of these games work as though... Oh, that one actually died pretty quickly. Vaga's... maybe just crit X isn't as strong as I... remembered. Well, he does just have, like, a dagger. He's more of a speed and item hunter, is more his role. If he needs to take some guy out, he needs, to, he needs to do a mirage dive. Like that other episode where I I utilized it to infiltrate South Figaro a little more efficiently. Well, it's not even that much more efficiently. It would cause a pretty big ruckus, actually, instead of being sneaky. But I guess it was just Squaresoft being all like, what if people can't figure out the puzzle? Well, then they can just... Uh, what do you call it? Bullheadedly try to get... Th beat the armor. Or maybe they just have it there so you can go, this armor is... is really strong. There's gotta be another way. So let's use Bio Blaster once again. That'll be pretty much Vaga's... Uh, tenure for this battle. Because I don't want to fight the mini-boss. I don't want him to fight the mini-boss, it's unnecessary. I may get these two to fight the mini-boss because... I think they're feeling a little... Uh, un underappreciated at the moment. They're just like, oh yeah, bring me to war, but don't use me at all. Don't use my effective anything. Get him, Gart. Sick him. Good kitty. Infect them with your claw scratches. I'm under the impression that claws are, are kind of dirty. But if they're walking around in kitty litter and stuff, I would expect a cat's paw to be... Not the cleanest. If, I mean, if I were to walk on my own poop, what do you... what would you imagine? The state of my foot cleanliness is... where do you think you're going? He's like, oh no. I are going to die. Alright, cats and dogs living together. Cats and dogs at war, once again. 900 damage. Oh, I don't want to use these guys for the mini-boss. I want to steal from the mini-boss. Good thought, though. Well, I'll, I'll attack you then. Oh, there's still quite a bit more left. A little bit of heavy armor. Let's scratch it! Let's scratch the heavy armor, because I'm a kitty. And runic, because I believe Magitek Laser... ...is distracted by it. That was pretty hefty. Runic again. Rolling the dice. There we go. That was lucky. Now heal us. Heal our party, Celeste. Convalesce our party. Did I use the convalesce pun yet? I know I wanted to. I just, I don't remember if I actually had. Now, now, don't be punching heavy armor. You should be... ...utilizing your cat scratches. Maybe I can utilize... 
my my super attack. Let's try it. Well, it killed it just the same. So it's almost as though it was a super attack, desperation attack. Back up healing. Yeah, attack you from behind, even though that makes no difference here. I feel as though it ought to. Yeah, Stray Cat, all the rage. Oh yeah, look at these swingers. Oh, look at Celeste using her... her blade to block that ferocious blow. Ow. Punched my face in my face. Let's do more healing. Although Magitek laser will kill one of them two. Well, it won't kill Gart. There we go. Let's just cut this guy and then scratch him with my fists. I don't know why I'm really bothering to level these guys, because I'm not really a... I don't really use them that much. I keep wanting to hit the wrong button. I'm sure you've noticed that that probably wasn't my plan. But you never can tell. So let's use another Noise Blaster and see if we can't get the Heavy Armor to Magitek Laser. <laughs> that was probably the best case scenario for them. So let's Bio Blast everybody. Yeah, let's Bio Blast them. Even though they're on my side right now. So yeah, get you all confused once again. In which case, I should be able to heal myself and not die. Yeah. Non-confusing... Confusing... Curing status... Laser... Attack. For everybody... Named Heavy Armor in this battle. Yeah. Two more... Bites of dust. Two levels for Vaga here. I think that's actually... Well, I thought it was all. Okay, Vaga. Things are faster with you. It never really occurred to me before that it's more of my not noticing things in this game again, visually-wise. That dog has so much armor on it. I thought it used to just be, I don't know, regular dog. Just... brownish skin. Gray. I guess it's gray. Skin. But now I notice it's armor. The more you know. Oh, that thing's not terribly bio-blaster friendly. I may as well just keep attacking it like that, then. Yay, celebration time. Now I'll take you out, and this is actually the end of you... You scoundrels rather not be surrounded. You can't always get what you desire. So let's bioblast this guy, get him out of our life for good. He'll be at it his own life as well. As well as this, this precious dog. I should heal. With, an, with a high potion. I was gonna say an X potion. But I want to save my X potions for when I need them, or I realize I'm fighting an undead enemy and I want to kill it really fast. So long as it has under 10,000 hit points. Turn you around, pup. I want to see you pounce yourself. How does that happen? Like that, I guess. Alright, so if a dog pounces itself, it dies. Bear that in mind in real life. So let's use the power team now, who has the the healer, and the thief, so we can get all sorts of good thievery stuff from this mini-boss. I can't even remember if it has anything good, but we're gonna find out. 
Hell's Rider. Zack's Rider. Magic. Eh, let's fire it. And steal. I really want to try to steal from it. So I'm going to guard for a bit, because I feel that it probably has something halfway decent. I feel it might have a spear, because it has a spear there, that would make sense. Although, just because something would make sense doesn't mean that it does. Ooh, a Venomist. Is that one who... Ooh, an Elixir. He doubles as a grandfather clock. Is a Venomous, like, someone who studies Venom? From the Spider-Man comics? Ooh, and a Remedy as well. A Distant Remedy! I only have one Antidote, but I do have Magic Antidote. Poisona! Then, more healing. Yeah... Mostly all healed. But yeah, that elixir isn't bad. I'm probably gonna have 80 elixirs at the end of the game, but nonetheless. Alright, it's time for Kefka! Let's see if I can't steal from this scoundrel. I'm gonna have to try to suplex him, though. Because suplexing is so much fun. Ooh, hi, after. That's not so bad. And I'd rather keep healing for later. What is it? Right, left, down, up. Yeah! Oh yeah, it's called... they call it Meteors. Oh, I can't suplex Kefka? What kind of cockamamie horseshit is this? Alright, you have no items left. You also won't have much in the way of life left after my power team is through with you. Defend, quick! Uh, crit X. Hit Sabini before he murders... before he suplexes himself. Before he issues a nuclear suplex attack. Vicious. Uh... Attack. I think my least favorite suplex to take is the German suplex. It's also my least favorite suplex to give. Well... Mostly because I wasn't giving them correctly. Grrr. Don't think you've won! <laughs> Ooh, a peace ring. Would have rather had a peace pipe, but whatever. Grrr. I won't forget this! Famous last words. Oh, and he's dead. And Cyan's all like, strike a pose. Got him. Where's the Esper? Is it alright? It could be... N if it's not alright, then there's none left. That's the only other option. Otherwise, you're going, like, half, like, half the way diagonally. Woo! The Esper's safe. It also appears to be... ALIVE! Is that even possible? I guess so. Terra, what is it? Oh no, you're gonna have some of that funky monkey business going on. No. Anything but what's happening. Gart just stand there, just like, hey, just hanging out. He he couldn't look less like concerned. Everyone's like dying. Oh my god, help! While Gart's just like, Ugh. I'm just gonna wait here while this cutscene ends. This is a lot of fun being down here. Vala Garmanda. Why couldn't it just be called Tritoch? I guess the Wolseyisms, like, people hated them so much they had to retranslate this game completely. So now I don't know the names of half the stuff. Please tell me, who am I? Who? You are Tara Branford. Tara! There was definitely a time where I knew everyone's names. I'd be lucky to have five accurate names. I can't remember, no, it's Loke Cole. Locke? Loke? I always say Loke. Loke, Cole, and then it's like the Figaro brothers, and one's like Rini, or Rene, and the other one's like Reno. Setzer, it's like Galib Galibaldi, or Gabu, something like that, some name like that. 
Uh, now I'm just trying to test my my memory. Cyan. Can't remember Cyan's last name. Right, the second. Cyan. That actually bothers me. I should know his name if anybody's. Celeste, I can't remember either. Gart, I don't think they ever tell you. Damn it, what was Cyan's last name? Anyway, we have to... Tara decided to have a throw a fit. And be like, I'm I'm gonna, I'm going out of here. I, she must have just begun menstruating, so she's just a little moody. So she's, she's just gonna fly halfway around the world. Just to prove a point. Just to be all like, pay attention to me. It's a good thing we have a drone following her, so we know where she's going. Well, I guess it doesn't actually show where she wound up. Uh, uh. I should say. Crit X will appreciate that. Uh. Are you awake? I need to make that noise more, actually, when I'm talking as Crit X. Where is Terra? Uh. She turned into a... Uh, something and flew off. She looked like... Uh, she looked like she was menstruating. I already spoiled it. She looked like an esper. Yeah, close enough. A PM esper? Yeah. Crit X! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm great. Yeah. Something happened to Terra. There must be some sort of connection between her and that esper. We need to find her. Witnesses said she went <laughs> she went streaking westward across the sky, beyond Figaro. I wish I... I wish I noticed her streaking. I guess she didn't have clothes, she was just some pink mask. We gotta hurry, I promise to protect her. <sighs> Crit X! Let's not get ahead of ourselves, the Empire will be back again for that Esper. And someone needs to protect Bannon! The Bananan. A former Imperial soldier. Yeah, if the... the guy's got to Bannon... in that last fight, it was game over. But I just didn't. Let's split up. Those who aren't searching for Terra will stay here to guard against further attacks. Figaro Castle can shuttle the others to the western province. Shouldn't be hard to track down clues in Cole Lingen or Jador as to Terra's whereabouts. As to her Terra boats. So I'm gonna use these four chaps. I will have the King Vaga lead the way, followed up by his twin brother. Nextly, we will put Cyan up there. And last but not least, Crit X will be at the bottom. Ugh. I I, I, I'm gonna make that old too fast. I just, I'm trying to make up for lost time. I should have been doing that already. I should really end the episode here. I can get another character right now. But I'm afraid I might screw up. Uh... How about this? If I screw up, I'll just get back here. Without using, or without showing you, and then on the next episode I'll be like, this is what you actually do. I'm pretty sure I can just go here right now. I stand corrected. I found the area where we normally would find Mog, or not Mog, but the sequence to trigger Mog, which is all the way down here. Allow me to show you. And then there's all these treasures. I collected all these. It's mostly stuff for Crit X, which I'll show you now. Crit X. So we got a Thief's Knives, knife that sometimes steals from an enemy, which is pretty good. And I thought I got, like, a Thief's... I thought I got other Thief stuff. I know I got a Thief Relic. Is that Mug? Is that the one that gives me Mug? Thief's Bracer. Oh, Bracer inhabited by the spirit of a thief increases the success of the Steel Command. Yeah, so that's what I want. Because the one that does Mug, I really don't like it so much because I, I can kill enemies. I, I want to steal from them, why would I want to kill them? So let's definitely equip the Thief's Bracer. And I'm sure one of these other bozos has sprint shoots on. Well, maybe I unequip them. Before that last battle, that seems to be the case. Uh, Cyan... I don't think you require... Well, you really don't need this anymore, I don't... That's what I say. So you can have your sprint shoes back. 
But yes, you want to check that treasure and like, I thought it was now. I thought you could get it now, but sometimes later. You can come back here. Only that chest in the back corner is locked. Wonder if there's a way to open it? So I'm going to peruse this town a bit more, see if there's any more stuff I can buy here that's useful. And then I will continue about my journey in Final Fantasy VI. Advance. So thank you very much for joining me today for that game that I just mentioned earlier. I still go by Megaharve. 